this is just insane. Just look at all of them. Oh my god. What? So many sets to go. Today, Zach Blake here. Today, we're going to be playing Yellow Neighbor once more. I'm so excited because we're going to have a fun time today. So what I did was I downloaded a mod called The Visitor. And the user who created this mod commented that there is an Easter egg in this uh, in this entire house. And I'm excited to find it. But what I did is I tried to spice things up. Now, this is called The Visitor. And when you think of Visitor, you can think of, like, spooky stuff. Like, the visitor is coming into town. Be aware. Or you could think of, like, hey, somebody's visiting and they're having a fun time. I'm going to change whatever story there is and make it my own. Because I like, you know, making my own story. Trying to make you guys happy. Cheering you guys up. I just want you guys to smile every time you watch a video. So, I thought, what if I add something? So, I worked really hard. Now, up there, there wasn't fences before. I added a little roofy thing. Um... Where basically we can go and grill and have a fun time with the neighbor. Now, if you imagine this as a story, it is like we are visiting in town. Let's say maybe we move back in and then we go, hey, neighbor, we move back in town. It's, it's good to see you. Do you mind if we come over and we can have a grill out on your roof? I mean, that's it's weird that I'm inviting myself over to his house, but it's like, hey, buddy, I haven't seen you in a while. Let's have a grill out like we used to. And so the neighbor's like, yes, I'm so excited to see you, but... I don't want you just having a good old time making things for me. I'm going to do something for you. I have hidden something in the house. In fact, I have locked all of my doors up so that you can find that secret present. And so here we are. We are in this neighborhood where there are giant houses. Like, you see that giant house? That's a big house. But then you look at the neighbors and it's like, geez, where did he get all this money? So we're like, oh my gosh, there's probably a crazy present in here. So we're at the neighbor's house. I don't hear him and I don't, I don't even see him in the room. But, we're gonna go see if we can find a present, and then have a grill out later with a neighbor. Let's do it! Alright, so first coming in here, I don't know why this fireplace is built up, but it's kind of like a cool game. It's like the neighbor made this whole game up, and he's starting to do all these things so that we can find our secret present. Because we've moved back into town. Now, I don't know how I would get into this. Huh. Yeah, I don't know if the neighbor's walking around or anything, but I'm, I'm scared. Alright, so I found outside. I don't know if we're gonna need to find anything outside. But, you can see this wall's way shinier. It's like he polished the wall. <laughs> Look at that! It's like shiny, not shiny. Jeez. Okay, well, there, it looks like there's nothing out here. Except for this. I don't know if we're gonna have to turn off the power or anything. But, ooh, this this, this looks really suspicious. We're probably gonna need a shovel for that. We're just getting all the things ready. We're gonna do the mind game. The mind game is the most important part. Figuring out all the stuff. Because once we find that stuff, we're gonna have a grill out with a neighbor. We're gonna have a fun time. Okay, so we got this off. Huh. Oh! And that is a key! Is that a blue key? Yes. I mean, the whole room looks blue, so I'm wondering if it's really the blue key. That doesn't even give me an unlock sound. We- Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> I just walked through there! Whoa! Look at that! I could I could just teleport through the wall! I am a magician! Look at that! <laughs> oh, that's cool. Okay, well, let's let's make our way upstairs. We have a blue key, and... Oh, jeez, this is complicated. The neighbor really has outdone himself, you know? Okay, blue key. Blue key. Here we go. Hmm. Hmm. There's just one lone chair in here, and a bunch of paintings. Probably has something to do with the paintings, right? Uh, ah! Ah! <laughs> Wait, what did I unlock? Huh. I, th I thought it would unlock this. Neighbor, where are you? Where are you? Okay, so the green key is now available for us. And the neighbor has now seen what we have done. Now, let's see what we've gotten here. Huh. So, um, what is it? Oh, there it is. I was like, what is in here? Okay, so we've got the yellow key. Um, hmm. I don't. Oh, wait, yeah, okay, so, here we go, we're gonna unlock this door, boom, oh, this leads outside, ah, so, this is where I put all the stuff onto the roof, we're gonna get a little bit of a taste of it before we actually start grilling with the neighbor, but it's like we've, we've snuck into the house and is like, getting ready to grill, so I set up all of this stuff over here, as you can see, I also added the, like, the neighbor just as, like, to see a test, to see if I can make him sit, but, like, as you can see, he's he's doing his magic. He's he's floating on nothing. So I don't know what he's doing there, but oh, 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 we are getting stuck. Okay, so as you can see, I've got a magical grill here, and this magical grill is steaming up some nice fiery flames. Now we're gonna be cooking these kebabs. 
So this kebab looks nice. It is like a tomatoey, bell peppery chicken cheese. I don't know. It's a block of something. And it looks really good. We're going to grill up later with the neighbor. And you can see uh, the neighbor's getting excited. He's practicing his sitting skills, maybe. And I added a bunch of chairs, so it looks like a party. So I'm excited. Okay, so coming up onto this big old... Uh, what this looks like a pool slash pond. Um, I don't know what we're supposed to be doing in here. But, um... Yeah, I mean, I mean it, it looks cool, but I, I don't think it leads up to anywhere because you can't even like get to over there I'm thinking maybe we've got to unlock something else. I'm not sure. All right, my dude So it turns out that I was using an older version of the map I'm gonna use this newer version now So now we can kind of get into this sense of like we know what's gonna happen now We have a little bit I think this is a newer version that's changed and this is the one with an Easter egg as well So I guess I was using an older version We can use that as kind of like our previous knowledge of the neighbor We could bring that into this story We could say like hey, we knew his house We knew what it looked like before because we've been over we're the neighbor's buddy So we have to know so maybe that also plays in so we got to be we got a little bit of a taste And now we're gonna go into like the newer version of the house Jeez, the neighbor's already standing there And so it's like the neighbor said come on in See if you can find the things now! <laughs> neighbor! Right, okay, so the neighbor is actually not chasing us. But he but he's, he's has this little scary mood. Now, the thing has changed. Everything has changed a little bit. So maybe we can work this into the story. So it's kind of like that was the past. We got to see what the neighbor's house was before. And we got to explore. But now we kind of got to do a lot... A lot different! This is cool! Okay, so we, are, we obviously know that there's going to be a key in here, right? Oh, man, it is different. It is completely different. It is it is a lot newer. Now, I didn't know that this is the one that I was supposed to go to because the game automatically puts us into that last one. So, this is just like the patched version. Let's see if maybe we can find something here. Now, it is completely different, but the neighbor is there. So, yes. So, the, the thing that we needed to get in the last one was that. I don't know where we're going, though. Can we walk through this thing still? Yes, we can. I mean, not completely. Oh, yeah, yes, completely. Okay. Um, don't know where anything is now for some reason. I can't even open up this. But you know what? Yeah, I know what it is. We have to go up onto this next floor. Oops. We're going to go up onto this next floor. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. That looks cool. We're going to go into... Oh, wait. Huh. What is this? We had to get the blue key the last time. We got the blue key from that other room. Hmm, maybe it's in here now. It's like the neighbor invited us back in and we have no idea what to do in his house. Well, we gotta do it. Come on. Where, where could things be? Hmm. 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 Here it is. I think I found it. What is this? This is a silver key. So it was on this room, but what is the silver key for? Silver key? And I'm not even prepared for this one. <laughs> this is all new. Maybe this one does open up the blue thing. Hopefully it does. Oh, wait. Now it turned blue. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Well, you you saw that, right? Ah, now we know that this is the one that opens up the second room. We're already moving fast. The neighbor's like, what? How do you have all this knowledge? How do you know where everything is? Yeah. Yeah. Now we're going to find it super quick. It's probably not in the close ones. We'll probably have to find in one of these earlier ones, right? Here it is! Here it is! Green key! Green key! Oh, that's the final key! That's the door! This is the door! The final door that we're supposed to get into! Okay, so that's where our present is! The neighbor, we're gonna find that! You're not gonna stop us! Alright, so that's- that's the thing. It's not melting. I'm hoping that leaving it open may cause it to melt slightly, maybe a little faster, but we're already making progress. Here we go. Boom. Unlock that. Oh! Oh, there's our Easter egg, my dudes! Jack Blake. All right, whoa. That's a lot of dolls. That's a, a, a weird. <laughs> okay, so we have our own room. This is the room before where we found the key on the bed, right? So is the key somewhere here, maybe under the bed, or over here? Huh. Hmm. We're gonna have to find this somewhere, right? It's probably hiding in plain sight, and I probably can't find it. There it is. Here it is. Red key. This one led to the yellow key the first time. And look, this is Dak Blake's room. Everybody stay out of my room. Oh, no, no. This is orange now. Huh. So, wait. I'm so confused. It looks so red in this room, right? It's just because of these lights. The keys are changing colors, but we still got our grill set up. Whoa. Whoa. What? What? I just... I got down and look I'm slowly falling back to earth no. 
Oh, we got a nice grill over here. Two kebabs are on the grill. It just started them. Neighbor, how's it going? You having a good old time there? Hey, buddy. So, um, I'm gonna invite a bunch of guests over. We're gonna have a good old time now. I don't know what we're supposed to be doing in here. It, It is very, very glitchy. But maybe we can glitch our way over. It, kind of. I mean, we're still not touching the ground. I think we need to make it to up there, right? I mean, it's like we're kind of moving. There we go. Maybe we can, yeah, maybe we can glitch our way up to there. It's, it's kind of a little weird, but... Hey, oh, look, 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 we're in the air. Come on. I'm spamming. Okay, I got it, I got it. Ho, oh, oh, ho, okay. I think I got it. It's still very, very glitchy, but... Ooh, there we go. Can this door open? Hmm. Whoa, whoa. So I ended up glitching my way through the door, and I ended up kind of in this weird spot. As you can see, I'm I'm not like flying or anything. Like I I'm like legitimately stuck. Like I, I'm just standing here and can't crouch, can't move. It, it's just like stuck. But I, I can open up this. I mean, I'm kind of moving out of it, but it it's like primarily primarily just stuck. <laughs> oh wow. Okay, so we got a key here. It is the. What? What is going on? See, so, I don't know what's going on, but every time I, I'm grabbing the key and it's just pulling me forward. Wait, what? Look at this! It's so weird! It is like, the neighbor is broke physics! Can I, like, at least jump to my death? No! I'm stuck- wait, ah! I don't know what's going on. All right, so we're in the final area. I've thrown all my inventory out. It, I mean, it's look, it's a little weird. Like, if, like, I throw the thing- it bounces off of invisible walls here. Don't know what's going on. But, um, yes, the key shall be rolling back to me in my hand. <laughs> it's like a magical key. Wow. Okay, uh, key, slide back to... Oh, nope, now it's stuck on the invisible wall. So I just got to uh, turn off this, and I think it unblocks the final thing. And then we can grill with the neighbor and see what prize he has given us. Alright, so I actually got the game to work again. I did a little bit of a magic trick uh, Like we've been doing always so I actually got it to work. I can run around a little bit more Boom. There we go. I think that's the last thing we need to get the final key. So let's go and do it All right, so here we are downstairs. It is slowly melting my dudes. We got to wait a little bit The neighbor is like you fixed it all out <laughs> Beware the present you wish for may not all be what you want Come on, hurry up! I'm excited! Everybody's waiting! We've been waiting for quite a while. It's kind of weird that somebody would put a block of water and put it into the freezer. So it's finally free. So I don't know how you would take a block of water without having like a box. He literally just poured water into the, free uh, the freezer with a key standing straight up and was like, Hey, here you go. And look, it's like a little ice cube and it's floating. <laughs> so let's finally take it! Let's see what we can do! Alright guys. Are you ready to go into the room? Are you ready to see what our present is? So, I went into the game editor and I added in this thing. So that what this leads to is normally the next act. But I wanted to add a little bit of the neighbor and our story into it. Um, now this is a great mod, obviously. But we added a little bit of a touch. I added the key to the neighbor's heart. It's like the neighbor cared for us all along. Now, I, you can't pick it up. It's gonna stay in the toilet. <laughs> I put the neighbor's heart key in the toilet, but um, as you can see, the neighbor has given us the gift of his heart. He cares about us, and the whole time, he didn't attack us. He just stood there, waiting, waiting for us to go and grill together. So, let's head up to the top. We're gonna go grilling. We're gonna have a good time, so let's, let's go hang out with the neighbor now. Alright, so the, the game might look a little bit different, but I went in and I added in a bunch of neighbors so that we can hang out and grill. I think I had to take out the grill because they kept getting like pushed around by the grill for some reason. So I think the collision in the grill maybe have been the problem, but I went in and I added um, a bunch of the neighbors. And so I wanted to see what we're going to do today. This is just insane. Just look at all of them. Oh my gosh! Okay, so we can actually see the situations going on. This guy's like getting yelled at by this guy. <laughs> you can see he's like, you're a loser! He, actually, he punches him. This guy's all mad, or not, like sad maybe. 
This guy's like frustrated, and this guy's getting ready to fight anybody. Now, I don't know what this guy's doing, but he's jumping on the thing back and forth. We got our original guy right here, just having a fun old time. We got the sleeping neighbor, just having a good old sleep. He's getting ready down to crawl. I don't know what he's doing. So they've just eaten a bunch of food. We've had a good old time. This guy, he's like, look at my belly. It's so big. <laughs> he's kind of talking. <laughs> look at that. He's like, hello. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, man. And then, okay, I don't, know what, I don't know what you're doing, but you're doing something suspicious. You're like punching the air and making sure that nobody sees you. <laughs> this guy's stuck. Oh, okay, so he's just, he's chilling. He's looking at our, our fantastic furniture right here. He's having a good old time. Are you having a good old time? And then <laughs> he's doing a magic trick. He's floating in the middle of the nowhere. And this guy's like, whoa. <laughs> so look, we have, a, we have a just a barrage of all the neighbors. This guy, what are you doing? I forgot. Did I see you? Oh, no, you're just polishing the floor. What are you doing? You're doing something in slow motion. Whoa. Whoa. I just added all these in just to see what they would do. What's he doing? Whoa. It's like they're all working out, kind of, in a way. But look, it's our neighbor balcony, and we're having a good old neighbor time. There's a pool there. We're gonna have a good old time. This actually took me over an hour and 15 minutes to record. I set up a bunch of stuff, having a good old time. Um, there actually is more to this that we could probably play continuously. The person who made this mod, his name is Jak Jaku Biku Kas. I'm probably saying it wrong. But this is an amazing mod. This is the fact that we have so much room to add upon it. We got to do a bunch of stuff. We got to go and find out our prize from the neighbor was his heart. We got to hang out and actually put in a bunch of neighbors. It's, it's, it's all just all fun. We got to just mess around in the game and rather than, you know, focus on just finding keys and doing all this stuff, we got to find our present that the neighbor found, uh, or what is it, left for us. And we got to hang out with all these neighbors. And you can kind of imagine this. Imagine this as one neighbor. Imagine him doing all of these things in one little continuous sweep. Like, first he starts here, then does this, then does this, then does this, then does this. And he goes around doing all these things. So we can, uh, we can imagine a neighbor just having a good old time. Or you can just imagine a party with the neighbors. Now, it's all about having a good old time and a fun time. And hopefully, I made you have a good time today. I made you. I made you have a good time today. Hopefully, I made you laugh. Um, hopefully I can play the granny and have a fun time tomorrow. Join me. We're gonna have an amazing time. If you're new, please subscribe. And if you've already subscribed, click that notification bell to become part of the notification squad. I've been starting to get to say that faster and faster. But yeah, just click that notification bell and you'll see my videos as soon as they come out. So thank you guys for watching. See you in that next video. And as always, peace out, my dudes.